So my biggest excuse for when people are acting like strange or unfriendly or like, you know, bad. When people are acting in a way that like causes us genuinely to feel like hurt, pain or suffering. When we feel disturbed emotionally, energetically and we feel sad and angry and like just very deeply upset ourselves. Which happens often like most of the, most days in a lot of people's lives to be honest. Because like, you have to raise your frequency, energy vibration and consciousness quite a lot a lot to like get out of that um level okay um my biggest sort of like um excuse or get out of jail card is not an excuse it's the reason it's, it's not an excuse you can't be excused excuse anyone or excuse yourself for doing um you know hurtful things but there's always a reason which we can look, look on upon compassionately with love and forgiveness also is that they're they're suffering you know, it's just a, it's, a, it's a funny thought in a way. You know, like to think they're they're just suffering, they're suffering, but it's true. So if you can remember that like people are suffering when they're acting in a way that you don't like and it hurts your feelings, just remember, I'm 100% responsible for the quality of my experience right now and in life, and I'm 100% responsible for my emotions. Just remember that. Say these affirmations to yourself. To yourself. And if you want, here's another one. May I accept, respect, and love this person exactly the way they are at this moment and watch them transform when you do that i promise you I'll give you my word um and then finally just recognize and remember that a lot a huge majority of the time people are suffering in some way shape or form when they act in a way that's belligerent confrontational or unfriendly to you check your reaction check your blaming or wronging them or shaming them let go of them work on forgiveness compassion and understanding and love and and care tune into your heart chakra instead of your head your head chakra but seriously i know i try to be a little silly sometimes but it's a really serious deep thing and if we it's our number one spiritual evolutionary step is how we relate and deal and respond or react to other human beings and other animals even too but especially other humans who trigger us. So own it, claim it, feel it, transform it, and be an alchemist. So yeah, I'll see you again in the video, and lots of love. Thanks for joining me in this collective human expansion of the bubble of the web, of the conscious rainbow expansion, the bubble bursting, and the ego transforming into butterfly, and all this sort of stuff, you know what I'm saying?